Before the opening bell, U.S. indices closing down on Friday, pressured by shares in tech hardware and equipment, semiconductors and semiconductor equipment, and energy sectors. On the economic docket, personal income released at 0.2%. On the month of December, while personal spending declined 0.3% in line with expectations. Now, the University of Michigan's Consumer Sentiment Index rising to 99.8 on a month-to-month -month basis on the January final read. Above the estimate, this all adds 94% of S&P 500 constituents traded lower or unchanged on Friday. Now, after the markets closed, Nike upgraded to buy from neutral over at UBS. While in terms of expectations today, we do have earnings from Alphabet and Cisco. Well, on the economic docket after the opening bell, we have market manufacturing PMI at 10 o'clock in the morning, ISM manufacturing new orders. Taking a look at the markets, the S&P 500 is where we begin. That sees its key resistance at 32.58. The Nasdaq sees its key resistance at 90.92. And the Dow Jones sees its key resistance at 28,450, as the upward potential is likely to be limited by the resistance at 28,450. Short positions below that figure are favored with targets at 28,240 and 28,100 in extension.